Hello, community. Conversational AI with JetGPT with the OpenAI key now in a Python notebook. Here in a Jupyter notebook and a Colab notebook. So, pip install OpenAI, import OpenAI, OpenAI key, you know your key. If you're still in the free trial period, you have 18 US dollars as a free trial, so use this for your key. You do not have to get your credit card ready. And then we just define here some simple command, get completion and get completion for message. We have, of course, here our model. We use here a very simple chat GPT, the GPT 3.5 Turbo. And we have here single messages, multiple messages. And as you see, for the visualization, because I want to have a little bit of a nicer output, I use panel. Panel makes it easy to combine widgets, plots, table, anything that you have a Python object to. And then, uh, yeah, maybe I should run this too. Beautiful. And then I have here a beautiful function, and I will show you in a second where this function comes from, where I say now collect all my messages. If you have seen my last video, you noticed that I have an interactive uh, conversation with a conversational AI because I defined a loop in my in-context learning prompt, in my instructional prompt for the system. Here I do exactly the same. I have here the role defined of a user and I have here a specific content that is a prompt. And then I have a role defined that is assistant. This is this chat GPT assistant now. The content is simply the, the response from chat GPT. And you can see now with the panels I have now that I have here my user input and here the reply by the system as assistant. Now, if you want to learn more about this, there is a beautiful, beautiful introductory lecture by Andrew and OpenAI. So let me just interrupt this and show you this. So here, a short recommendation. If you want to learn about instruction tunes, LLMs, this is a free course, deeplearning.ai, chat GPT prompt engineering for developers. You have here a very nice introduction. The course is free. It takes about one hour. And as you can see, you have here from OpenAI and our beloved instructor. So you know what you can expect. The nice thing, and I just want to jump here a little bit in before, is you have here uh, Open Jupyter already done for you. You just have the code segments and you just execute here the code segment. So you can import here your OpenAI key or they provide you here a free key for the moment. And then you see here, you go here with every cell they show you, they explain to you. Let's jump here a little bit in front of you see. You have here the complete Jupyter Notebook, and here they go with you step by step. So I highly recommend this course. You have then here, try experimenting on your own. So they give you a little bit freedom that you can use this system. You do not have to deposit your credit card data or anything at all. You just have to log in with your email. This is exactly what I did, and you get a very good idea about it. There is about summarization, of course, and as you can see, let's start this one. It is the same structure all over. You have a Jupyter notebook on the left side, and you have some theoretical explanation on the right side. So you see summarization, the text to summarize, how to summarize word, sentence, character limits, focus on shipping and delivery, for example. So if you want to learn more about OpenAI API interface functionalities, here is an expert from OpenAI telling you exactly how to do summarization, inferring, transforming, expanding, chatbot, and, and, and. So really nice course, recommended highly because they provide you an interactive free Jupyter notebook. Try it out, it is between OpenAI and deeplearning.ai. So now that you know everything, 
here now I have defined the context of the system. So this is the system command you have seen in my last video, when on the left side there was here the system input. And now I do the same as in context, the rule of the system, so this is the master AI system if you want, and then here as content, here I have again the same command here that I used in my last two videos, I say you want to be an advanced and intelligent idea creator. We have three responses, A, B, C. If you optimize the text, you have new ideas, you have open question, and we go in a loop with this. So absolutely the same. So you have it now on the pure chat GPT. Then you have it here in a Python, in a Jupyter notebook, and tomorrow you will see it on the playground by OpenAI. So then you have three platforms where you can implement this. Beautiful. So let's execute this, that it now has the system, the master AI has now the content, what the master AI should do. And then I am the user here, and the assistant now is the response by ChatGPT. Beautiful. So we just define here a little bit our dashboard that we have a nice output, but here we go. Collect messages is not defined. Yes, if I do not execute this, it's, yeah, there, there could be, a, yeah, you are absolutely right. Thank you. So here we go. I have here, yeah, the user and the assistant. So enter your text here. Wow, can hardly read this. Let's make it a little bit bigger. So I want to create a homepage about organic AI in fluid systems. That you see now connects now to OpenAI server, gets ChatGPT. We have to pay for this, of course, and I'll show you in my next video how much it is. So you see here now, this is my input. I want to create a homepage about organic AI and fluid systems. And then it comes now back with my ABC, exactly what I told him. And it reminds me, hey, either you continue or you type end. So this is now the output of the system, the first approximation. Welcome to our homepage dedicated to organic AI and fluid system. Latest insight development in the field of organic AI and its application fluid system, bringing you informative design to understand everything. Beautiful. New ideas. We have a section of the benefits of organic AI, the showcasing successful applications in organic AI, what specific fields I'm interested in. So I go now back here. Yeah, maybe this is, this is a horrible color. You have to change the color. And I say, so I say chat. Uh, we'll wait till it connects to OpenAI and we have to pay another time. So you see here now, this was my first response. This is now my second response. And here is now again here the optimized text here. Bring the most from the inside on the protein based AI and its application. So you see, you go on, you go on, you on, and you can optimize continuously. Maybe I should put in here this chat uh, input also in the panel, in the dashboard, but yeah, you can optimize it as you like it. And then so again, we go, yes, another time. Here we go. Connecting, paying, syncing. And here you see, and I want to embed a lot of my YouTube videos and interactive demonstration. And then he comes back and yes, A team committed bringing you in from down. Demos here. Interactive demos and video content to enhance your learning experience. It's nice, nice in the way he wrapped it up here in a nice sentence. And then you go on, include highlight, interactive demos. Yes, yes, yes. So let's say now, okay. Where are we? And this is now the part where I say part one is finished. Now we go to part two. 
So he says, he gets it, he says, great, in the next step, as a designer, I will need you to provide me more information about the structure and the elements you want to include in your homepage. This will help me create a layout that perfectly suits your needs. So you get it now, you go back, you say, oh yeah, fact-based. Whatever this means. So here we are again. Thinking, connecting, ping. Yes, 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 come on. Oh. Yes, and I'm gonna, yeah, exactly. This was my last input. And then he comes back and says, hey, great, here's the first layout, the hero section, visually striking image or video showcasing the essence of your website, then the about section, a brief introduction to its mission, for features video section, highlights your most popular informative videos, interactive demo section, the benefits section, the case study section. So you get the idea, it works beautifully. As you can see, it's in Python, it is so easy. Yeah, let's make it a little bit smaller that you see the whole system. It is just that you define here the get completion commands, the functions, and then here, the, if you want, collect messages this is what you would normally use an outside vector database outside vector store for but since we are here in an interactive process no problem at all to have this here within uh, our our primary artificial intelligence system and this is as we have chosen here a gpt 3.5 turbo model available for you. The temperatures are increased a little bit from 0 to 0 0.3 to have a little bit, a little touch more creative. But of course, we should not go for one because then you are really, really imaginative in your content. And maybe you try it out. Have a look what comes out. If it fits your task, this would be the perfect application. I say thank you. I hope you enjoyed it. You learned something and I see you in my next video.